Hi, in this video we're going to talk about the history of fast food and its culture in Indonesia. If we trace back into the history of the modern world, the first fast food ever made was an automat. Automat itself was the fast food restaurant where simple foods and drinks were served by vending machines. The world's first automat was named Cuisiana, which opened in Berlin, Germany in 1895. Fast forward to 1978, this is the year when fast food first entered Indonesia. Since then there have been so many fast food joints growing and spreading all across the archipelago. And now in 2017, large fast food joints like KFC, Hoka Gabano, and Carlos Jr have dominated different segments of Indonesian fast food loving citizens. Now, the first fast food to ever enter Indonesia may be KFC in 1979, followed by Hoka Gabano, founded in 1985, and Carl's Jr., just recently in 2010. But in fact, the history of the respective restaurants are pretty much different. KFC was founded by Connor Harlan Sanders, an entrepreneur which began selling fried chicken from his roadside restaurant in Carbon, Kentucky, during the Great Depression. Sanders identified the potential of restaurant franchise concept, and the first Kentucky fried chicken franchise opened in Utah in 1952. The first KFC restaurant in Indonesia was opened on October 1979 on Malawi Street, Jakarta. KFC in Indonesia primarily serve fried chicken, but also serve other kinds of fast food like hamburger, french fries, and more. Now, here's how Indonesian people usually behave when dining in KFC. On April 18, 1985, Hoka Hoka Bento was first founded under the administration of Eka Boga Inti Incorporated. The company was first founded by Hendra Arifin with the first restaurant situated on Kebon Kacang Central Jakarta. In the present day, Hoka Hoka Bento has had 141 joints spread across the island of Java and Bali. Hoka Hoka Bento serves fast food which are arranged similar to cafeteria's buffet table where customers can pick their own preferred dishes along the buffet table. The food served by restaurants include Yakiniku, Teriyaki, and a lot more. And now, here's how Indonesian people usually behave when dining in Hoka Hoka Bento. Carlos Jr.'s predecessor was founded in 1941 by Carl Karcher and his wife Margaret. It started as a hot dog cart in Los Angeles. In 1945, the Karchers moved to Anaheim, California and opened their first full-service restaurant, the Carl's Drive-In Barbecue. The business then grew into a legendary brand up till this day. Carl's Jr. first expanded into the Indonesian market back in 2010 with their first restaurant located in Jakarta. Their mainstay products are hamburger products, along with unlimited free-flow refreshments bar. Now, here's how Indonesian people usually behave when dining in Carl's Jr.
Now, did you notice any similarities between people's behavior in all three places that we had mentioned earlier? The similarity is that we've all taken chili sauce after we receive our foods. Yes, chili is something that most of Indonesian people just cannot skip when eating their dishes. Alright guys, that's it for our short video about some food history in Indonesia. Hope you guys like it. See you on the next one.